a DSA question based upon stacks and queues. We have been given the following set of operations that are performed on an empty stack. Let us see what is the result of that. This is our stack. Initially, it is empty. The first operation is push 54 into the stack. Then we push 52 into it. And after that, the next operation is pop. So this 52 will be popped off from the stack. Next, we push 55. Then we push 62. And finally, S equal to pop. The pop returns the topmost digit, which has been popped off from the stack. In this particular call, we did not uh, return the value from this pop. We do not hold that value returned by this pop. But here we are holding that value in this variable S. So S will retain this value of the popped element 62. It will be popped off and the stack which is now left out is it is having elements 54 and 55 only. So we are done with the stack operations. Now an empty queue has been given and on that we are performing this set of operations. So let us see. This is our queue. NQ21. So we NQ that from this end. Then we are enqueuing 24. We are enqueuing from this end and we will dequeue from this end. So 24 is enqueued. Then we are doing dequeue. Again, the value returned is not being hold. So this 21 will simply be removed. Next operation is NQ28. So from the rear end, we are entering this value 28 into the queue. After that, NQ32. And finally, Q equal to DQ means the value which is at the front of the queue will now be deleted and that would be hold in this variable Q. So this Q will be holding this value 24. And our resulting queue will just have elements 28 and 32. So now the variable S is holding value 62 and variable Q is holding the value 24. And we have been asked the value of S plus Q. So that would simply be 62 plus 24, which is 86. So the answer for this question is simply 86.